paper on you. <laughs> I think I got it all over your back. Oh. And it didn't come from the can. <laughs> Start up. Three. <laughs> Good cut. Good morning, people all over the world. You guys are here watching this video to experience Japan. Get your ass over here. Today, you're helping us pay for your, I mean, our parking. They're all numbered. That's space one. Number one. And I think you hit F1. Oh, oh that's not bad. Wow. That. $62. Today, we're going to take you guys to some of our favorite spots to spend some money. Yeah. Or, or you don't have to. Whether you're a car girl, car guy, or just a person that loves Japan, we're gonna take you and show you guys around. So you guys know what to do next time you're here. Eat it. Eat it. What the fuck? Good to go. We kind of broke the Alteza. Power steering doesn't work anymore. Let's see how hard this is. Make sure when you come to Japan, get a nice working car. Try to turn the wheel. Oh my god, it's like it's parked. <laughs> You're clear, keep going, keep going, keep going. Well, turn it, turn it. Do not get a Alteza. <laughs> yeah, let's not drive the prices up. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah no suck. one no one wants these cars. Uh -huh. Yeah, Alteza suck. <laughs> Ready? Let's see how much this one costs. Can't read Japanese, but I do know. I think I just realized that. I think that means delete. <laughs> <laughs> 9,000 yen is approximately $60. Not bad for two nights, huh? Dude, this is... Hey! Hey! Where'd the money go? Huh? <laughs> Parking is officially paid for if you guys are coming to Japan on a budget. Take the train. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, parking is expensive and you literally have to pay literally everywhere you go. Tolls, gas. <laughs> yeah, or use the 210. <laughs> You're two feet and ten toes. Let's there get out of here. Stop number one is the spot to go for all you fellow car enthusiasts. A pet super auto box. He no no man. This is the biggest auto box in Japan. So if you come here, be sure to check this place out. We were just at the car wash, which we'll show you guys later. You can buy tires here. But if you follow me this way. Are you guys ready? So you know how we were saying earlier that it's not only for car people? So just say you bring your girlfriend, right? Just take her over there 
and there's a Starbucks. <laughs> So you could hang out there and sip a lot. <laughs> you gotta pick these up. Five bucks. Work wheel valve No caps. way, that's five bucks. Yeah, just in case someone steals your shit. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm happens. always missing some. Yeah. Okay, hey, quick question for you. You've yeah. been hanging out with us long enough. What car is that? Sylvia. Good job. No way. This is JC Pepino. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to the boy. 30 bucks you can have your own JC Pepino. <laughs> Matt, come here, look. <laughs> I can read Japanese. Is it better? Not these. <gasps> I know how to speak I know how to speak Japanese now. <laughs> so lame. <laughs> right over here we've got the phone mounts. I'm just gonna grab something real quick to show you how cheap these are. This magnet here, around $14. This one right here eight bucks this whole aisle right here are all air fresheners oh one aisle over are the ashtrays the japanese really love to smoke cigarettes inside their cars here they've got a starbucks for you to stop and chill grab some drinks manga right over here come by What'd you get? Yuzu iced tea. There's little chunks of like yuzu in here and it's a little citrusy, a little sweet. On this side is all of the cleaning supplies. Anything that can clean your car will be here as well as window wipers, cameras. I'm gonna show you guys my favorite part. This is just regular car stuff. But if you go upstairs, that's where all of the cool stuff hide. Ooh. I told you all the cool what? stuff lie up here. <laughs> what up, buddy? Are we hanging out? Yes. Oh, God, hold on. I miss you. <laughs> there you go. Just a little, hey, congrats on your win again. Oh, thank you so yeah, much. Yeah, you was good. You know, well, I, I practiced real hard for that. My new favorite thing? I don't know. I have a bad back. No. I'm bringing this butt cushion with me everywhere. No way. Yeah, you start to that. My favorite thing I found on the fan. I can do your butt cushion. You could. That's so random to see you guys say hi. Hello. This is your first time here, huh? Give me the tour, dude. Let's skip all of these. You guys can come here and find out yourself. But my favorite is right over here. My first time here, I was like, I was tripping out. We've got the seats, obviously. Tail lights. Right over here, we've oh, got wow. all the Nismo goodies. Oh, wow. Yeah. And then right behind you guys, Mugen for all of the Honda guys. I thought so. There's a little, bit, a little bit of something for everybody. Yep. And then they also have the Nardis and the cool steering wheels and such here. Do you know how to read Japanese? Uh, yeah. Let me open my translating app. <laughs> <laughs> I really, really need a steering wheel in my Subaru because I have to sit so close to the wheel. You'll find a little of everything here. Yeah, you pretty much don't know what you'll find. You just literally have to walk around. Oh, it's like I found Adam again. <laughs> I'm gonna take you home with me. All right. No freaking way, guys. HKS Nardi. Dude. 600 bucks, never mind. All right, Matt. What would you rate Autobox out of 10? 10. 10? 10. 10. 10. Really? Yeah, yeah, there's so much stuff in there that I want to buy, but halfway across the world is not letting me buy everything because you can't carry engines and seats and tires and I don't know what else they got in there that's big, that's cool. All right, Wheeler. Out of 10, what do you rate Autobox? A 9.3, why? If I had a car, like crazy race car like I used to, it'd be a 10 out of 10. But I just bought air freshener. Car's not so good now. We're down. What about you? What do you rate Autobox? They had a they had a Starbucks. 10 out of 10. Get it all creamy. We're gonna need a little bit more cream. <laughs> hey Matt! I think I got it all over your back. Oh shit! And it didn't come from the can. <laughs> that sounds like a video game. Stop though.
I forgot to mention guys, outside of Auto Box is a car wash as well. Usually this is all full and there's a line waiting in here. Huh? What? <laughs> Come here. Can you hear me? <laughs> Damn, look at this hustler. Mass. Not you, bro. This thing right here. <laughs> Suzuki Hustler. <laughs> I have a crush on the owner of that car over there. I'm gonna leave, leave him a little note. We just showed up to some random lot and they got this clean FD RX-7. Looks like my white one, but black. S15. Over here, they've got the super rare OEM yellow S15. Let's see what else we can find. Don't know what this is. It's got an E36, Mazda Prius. Wait. Oh, sick, they've got a Ferrari. Oh, it's on work wheels. Whose car is this? Oh, there's pride seats. And it's a gated six. Wait, this is that one YouTuber's Ferrari. Oh, it is, it's a Liberty Walk Ferrari. What's that one channel? Ill Illuminati? Yeah, Randork or something owns this. Cool. Whatever. You guys wanted Ferrari content. That's the Ferrari content. <laughs> Hopefully one day we can buy one. Spot number two, guys, is my favorite. Big Bang, what is Big Bang, Matt? Big Bang has go-karting, baseball, was it pool? Slot cars. Ping pong Slot cars. and darts. And darts. Yeah, ping pong and darts. We are here for the drift carts. Yep. You guys have probably seen this on TikTok. We're gonna show you guys. Let's go in. Mina, you go. You Good cut. That was a good cut. Woo! Damn. Big bang. This is the machine right here, guys. For five games, it's 2,000 yen. All right, when you put your 2,000 yen in the machine, you get this card that gives you five plays. Hurry up, Habibi. There you go, push, go. There you go. And then, you get your card.
The cool thing about this is you don't even need to know how to drift. Just grab all your friends that came on the Tokyo trip with you and head here and just go have some fun. When in Japan, make sure to grab as many car parts as you can. Simon leaving with the Vertex Brides, Recaros, and my heart. <laughs> Have a safe flight, buddy. I'll see you in Canada. Yeah, for sure. Good ass trip. Hey, Simon, if you can't get these seats onto the plane for whatever reason, call me. I'm busting a U turn, and uh, you can take these, but I'll take this one. Okay? Oh, yeah? yeah, that's just this one. Okay? Bye. All right, Simon, get home safe. Spot number three to check out is Don Quixote. It's the best superstore in Japan, hands down. Yep. And what makes this one special is it's the mega. Yeah, we drove an hour, hour and a half all the way here to show you guys this. We just wanted to show you guys the best Don Quixote in town. is usually where all of the snacks are. Make sure to grab a basket so you can bring home some snacks. Check this out. They've got Gucci. That's around $350. They've got the LV bags. And I heard that everything here is real. It's crazy that it's real and it's behind these jank glass. Look, Michael Kors, more Gucci. Um, this is all tax free too. When I say they have everything at the store, I mean they have everything here. From real watches to even fake watches. As you guys know, the exchange rate in Japan right now is insane. The US dollar is so much higher. And I'm always buying a bunch of stuff. So this is where I actually go to buy suitcases. This one is $60. Back at home, this would be over $100, easy. If you guys are a Pokemon lover, there's literally Pokemon stuff everywhere you go. <laughs> Put it on again? Dude, that looks hella sick. You look steezy as hell like that. I can't see. Let me hold on to you. Okay. We lost Matt. Where did he go? <laughs> can't even see out of these. What are you grabbing, buddy? Oh, nothing. I wasn't grabbing anything. I wasn't grabbing anything. <laughs> what is this? There's not Hot it's Tanga. It's nothing. It's nothing. So, um, yeah, this one gets warm without having to put it in the microwave. <laughs> All right, guys, we're gonna walk through the car section real quick. Let's see what they've got. Bluetooth devices. Right over here, we've got cup holders, ashtrays, steering wheel covers. They even have oil here. That's crazy. Both of these aisles are air fresheners. If you guys get lucky, there's Don Quixote's that have racing helmets as well what are you getting matt i'm getting a nintendo switch but it's a pokemon edition so i don't know what pokemons these are because i don't know anything about the new ones but our flight doesn't have tv so gotta keep busy oh wario son oh legend of zelda tears of the kingdom if you guys happen to have a passport stop by the tax free counter so you don't have to pay for taxes 
Last episode, he showed us the money hack. This time, we're gonna show you the reservation hack. So, we didn't call to make reservations at this super popular pizza place. We're gonna free up a table. Bust out one of these. Put it in your pocket. All right, and now the table's free. Watch, check this out. I'll be right back. Because you're looking at us. He gave me money to leave. <laughs> <laughs> Unlimited money hack. Well, if it's on your hand. How much have you lost in Pachinko? Mm. I don't remember. My first time here though, like I thought I won so much. I redeemed all of the points. I got enough for a water bottle. <laughs> That's when I learned a new Japanese word. What was it? Mizu. <laughs> <laughs> It's got tuna on the margarita. It's pretty cool. And what do you get? That's, that does not look halal. It is. In a different country. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. Margarita. Bon appetito. What'd you get? Margarita. Mm. Mm -hmm. Good morning, everybody. It is our last day in Japan, and we have to show you our favorite ramen spot. Oh, no. No! Oh, no. That's the line. No. There ain't no line, it ain't gonna be fun. There's no way. This is it. We miscalculated. The line is actually all the way back here, but it's a must. Before we get in line, we're gonna have to go to this machine. But you're gonna need some cash. This is what I get, the special ramen. I want an egg and a Coke. That's it. Show them this and you can get your meal. Once you're done, tap this. And there you go, you get all your cash back. In America, they call this a Coca-Cola. Here in Japan, they call it Coca-Cola. Now you know. Here it is. Look at how soft and tender the meat is. It's crazy. It literally melts in your mouth. Hey, can I hit that? Thanks, bro. That's all I needed. Yeah, bring all the money. What do you mean you want me to type it in? Just one with a bunch of zeros. <laughs> okay. All right. We're good. I don't know what they're saying the whole time. <laughs> <laughs> all right, guys. Our Japan trip is coming to an end, and I have one last advice for you guys. The Pasmo or the Suica that you guys have been using, uh, if you have any extra points on it. Let me show you guys what I did with my points. Yeah. What'd you do with your uh, extra points? You want to see? Yeah, let's see. Exactly what you did. <laughs> <laughs> we getting choto faded. <laughs> Sayonara. All right, Sunny, what are you grateful for? I'm um, grateful for my friends, for family, for health, for wealth, for uh, uh, this moment. Can I say something? What? What did he say? <laughs> what are you grateful for? What did I drink before? <laughs> what are you oh, grateful for? What are you grateful for? Oh! <laughs> what are you grateful for? all my friends and like living a life that's very memorable. Mm. Actually, this guy. Thanks for him. What's up, boy? What? I'm grateful to all, have all my friends. Look at, look at all of them. Thank you. Eliminate. <laughs>